Hey guys, how are you? I hope you all are doing good. And it's Fahad from Autoprovider.com. And today I am back with another amazing custom ROM for our admin Note 11 users. This is the Paranoid Android, and its version is two part uh, two pass beta one, and it's it is based on Android 13. As you can see here, its Android version is 13, and security patches this ROM is also all the way latest 5 January 2023. So this ROM is pretty much stable. It's been more than two or three days I have been using this and uh, it's working pretty much fine. Today in this video I will be showing you its features, what customizations we have in this ROM and I will also show you its full review and I will also tell you if, uh, if it is a stable ROM for daily usage or not and at the end of this video I will also tell you how you can install it on your Redmi Note 11. So without any further ado, Let's get started. Before starting the video, make sure to subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon for the future updates. So first of all, let's start from the stability of this ROM. This ROM is completely stable. There is no any single bug or issue in this ROM. Everything is just working fine. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, mobile data, hotspot, Volti, every single thing is just working fine. And the performance of this ROM is also pretty much good. As you can see here, the animations are also played very well. And if we talk about the applications, here we have some applications only few and needed applications have been installed so don't worry about this games uh, i just downloaded it myself from uh, play store so otherwise this rom is pretty much clean and simple let me show you its geekbench scores history and here we have it it just scored 377 on single core and it scored 1607 on multi core which is pretty much impressive so these scores are really impressive. By the way, we also have the abstract application for amazing wallpapers. So you, you can simply uh, download and apply a lot of amazing wallpapers by using only this application. And by the way, in the camera, here we have Google camera pre-installed. As you can see here, here we have portrait mode, photo mode, video mode, and here we have the translation. Maybe this is a go mode of Google camera and uh, if you want more features like uh, slow motion time lapse and all other things then you can go for a, a open camera from play store or you can also go for a google camera mode from the google.com so other than that every single thing is just amazing from the left you can access the google feeds by the way you can also customize your uh, home screen to make it looks pretty much beautiful as i did as you can see here you just need to go to the home screen settings and from here you can manage the looks uh, launcher settings then we have widget options from here you can add a lot of widgets to your home screen to make it unique then you can also add wallpapers right from here a lot of wallpapers are pre-installed so other than that here we have wallpaper colors dark theme themed icons app grid system icon pack and system fonts are also available right here so now let's go to these settings and have a look on the customer. The home screen is looking pretty much cool, isn't it? It looks pretty much beautiful. And the quick settings looks like this. You can simply adjust and uh, edit the shortcuts right from here. And in the settings here we have user logo, search, then we have connectivities, apps, notification, battery. The battery backup of this ROM is pretty much impressive. Here we have battery usage, battery saver. We also have the extreme battery saver right here. Adaptive battery, you can also enable the battery percentage for status bar. Then we have optimizations profiles. After it, we have the storage option, sound and vibration, and in the sound and vibration, a lot of options are added right here. And we also have the Mi sound enhancer, which will be uh, helpful to enhance the sounding quality. And we also have the uh, hi fi, it will simply decrease the noise and distortion from the audio. We also have the clear speaker right here. After it, here we have display option. And in the display, here we have uh, dark mode. You can also adjust the size of text and display. Nightlight is available right here. Icon manager is also available now in the dis uh, display options. Then we have the color profiles. And we also have uh, option to enable the smooth display, which will automatically raise the refresh rate from 60 to 90 hertz for some content like scrolling on social media while playing games and here we have the force peak refresh rate so we don't have uh, any option to set up the uh, minimum or maximum refresh rate in this room but still we have the smooth display 
and uh, four speed refresh rate these options are enough to get higher fps after it here we have wallpaper and style accessibilities security in the security all security options are available right here as you can see here screen locks are also available and you can also use the face unlock and fingerprint at the same time as you can see here face unlock is also available so no need to be worried about the security of this room then we have privacy location detail well-being which is the updated one then we have system in the system we have languages and input gestures and in the gestures here we have quickly open camera system navigation bar one-handed mode you can simply operate the whole screen by using only one hand then we have uh, lift to, to check phone let's see if it works and it is working pretty much fine it is pretty much surprising as you can see here let's try it again it is working pretty much now the flagship features is also available in this room so after it here we have press and hold power button swipe three fingers for skin shoot playback control using the volume buttons quick torch premium ringing screen of gestures then we have date and time backup system updates you can also check for the updates right from here and if any update is available you can simply download it right from here so because it is a official build the updates will be available to download right here then we have rules multiple user and reset option and at the end here we have about phone right here and from here you can check your panaroid version which is the two pass beta 1 and here we also have the android version which is android 13 the security patch of this rom is also pretty much latest as you can see here it is based on android 13 and its security patch is 5 january 2023 this rom is pretty much stable and you can also use it as your daily driver so no need to be worried about anything in this rom security options are also available there is no any single bug or issue in this rom performance is also pretty much good battery backup is also impressive so if you want to install this rom on your redmi note 11 then you can check the uh, installation instructions on your screen by the way the download link for this rom is in the description box uh, you can go and download it out from the description and if you want more videos like this then you can hit subscribe to this channel and if you have any question or queries about this video then you can let us know in the comment sections and you can also join us on the telegram telegram group and channel link is in the description box keep supporting thanks for watching subscribe and also press the bell icon for the future updates see you in the next video